We are here at the New Haven Boys and Girls Club for a day of caring. And that is when we celebrate the 25th birthday of Nexstar, our parent company, and we do some good work in the community. We give back to the people who watch us and the people who make our state such a great place to live. So we celebrate our anniversary, our birthday, every year by giving back to the community. It's a big part and foundation of what Nexstar Media is all about. Here at News 8, all of Connecticut is our community. Today we're in New Haven helping out the Boys and Girls Club. The kids are going to come back this summer after not being able to be here last summer and are hopefully going to have a wonderful, wonderful time. The support from News Channel 8 today is absolutely stupendous. It's Christmas in June. Yeah, this is good malt. Today I'm a master of raking, so I'd like you to check out how smooth that mulch looks. I would have to say this is my first experience with a pitchfork. This is the first time I've used a hammer, probably since my dad tried to teach me 10 years ago, but I think I did an okay job. <laughs> am, am, I, am I holding this left-handed or right-handed? It is very helpful to have a power drill, because if you don't, it's gonna take you about, uh, well, this will take a long time. This is right-handed, yeah. okay. You know, the kids who have been coming here for four or five years, they'll notice the new walls, and they'll ask about you know, who helped out, and I think, um, it's something that's been really cool during this hard time to see the community come together. Uh, Channel 8, WTNH has always been a big part of the community. It was the first TV station in Connecticut. In fact, this year we celebrated our 73rd birthday. And we've always had a big commitment to the community. So it's just great to be outside today in this beautiful weather with our team after the pandemic and be able to get together and do some good for the community. I think for the kids who've been here in the past, they are going to be tickled pink or maybe tickled blue. And so I'm uh, delighted to have you and can't thank everybody enough.